Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And it's first time around for these two countries in the group stage here at the 2023 World Cup. It's Argentina, and they take on Sweden. Well, thanks Derek, this is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. The Argentina first team. Well, it's a flat 4-5-1, which would suggest they're going to try and play on the counter-attack. However, that will only work if they don't drop too deep and can't support the main striker. Here's the starting 11 for Sweden. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And so the match is underway. Moving forward effectively. Now who can she pass it to? Oh, surely! And not quite on target. Unfortunate, you've got to say. Yeah, a little bit unfortunate. It's good technique. She makes good contact, but it needs to be on target to trouble the keeper. Well, possession seeded. Oh, showing excellent vision. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Oh, a nice looking pass. Real chance. Well, a wild swing at the ball in the end. That was what it amounted to. bad pass well with tackling like that the onus is on the referee to take action potentially well the card is out and it's yellow yeah it's clumsy and it's late definitely a yellow card a very good tackle
Fridolina Rolfe. Oh, she's made a crucial tackle there. Moving it forward. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Clearing the lines. And so it will be a corner now. It hasn't come to very much. Out of play for an Argentina throw. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. A bit wasteful from Argentina. Natalie Bjorn. Filipa Angeldahl. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. And the corner's been given. Who's going to get on the end of it? A deft clearance. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Kosovari Aslani. Rutin Kanerud. Really well played pass. And making the run to the inside. And nicely parried away. Well, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? Delivering it. Well, the save wasn't all that taxing. Did her job, though. Mariana Larroquete. Good movement. And let's give credit to the defending. Rolfe. Showing good defensive judgment. Moving forward effectively. Able to get a body in the way. Vanessa Santana. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. They need to get bodies back. And reading. Can they forge ahead? It's goalkeeping of the highest class. Well, that should be a goal, really. But what a wonderful save that was. Brilliant from the goalkeeper. She's just saved her team there. And a good take under duress there. Rutin Kanerud. And the keeper can gather. Cometti. Rodriguez. Can she score? Determined block. Argentina will get the throw in. And options in the centre. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. And that pass could be troublesome. Oh, fine stop. Played over. Oh, a vital interception.
And a throw in for Argentina. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Real chance. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Who can they pick out? And there it is, the half-time whistle. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. We're getting the ball forward, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Magdalena Eriksson. And giving the ball away. Kosovari Aslani. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. And teammates to play it to. And that is how to block. Could be a chance to break here. Can they take advantage of the situation? Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly read. Must take the lead here. Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Perfect challenge. Rolfe. Well, no problems defensively. Could take the lead. Well, fantastic reflex action. And over it comes. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. La Roquette. Breaking at pace. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Sweden recovering possession well. Johanna Ritting Kanaru. And quite simply, wide of the target. And time for the change now. And they have possession again. Johanna Ritting Kanerud. An alert piece of defending. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. Oh, she's in a really promising position. Oh, in it goes at long last. Deadlock broken. Will that be the one that gives them the win? Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. The fans imploring her to shoot. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the position they were in. Rolfe. Tremendous ball played through. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done.
Well, as you can see, Argentina have found it difficult to control the tempo of the game here. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Now well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. Really a very poor ball. Well, they might be onto something. A really top-notch piece of defending. Romina Nunez. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. A fine use of the ball. Now can she pick out a teammate? This could finish it! Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Let's see about the delivery. And still dangerous. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Opportunity here. And she's in the mood today. She's gone and made it a double. Well, here it is again. And the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Well, it was a risky challenge, but brilliantly executed. Had a chance to whip it in here. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And a substitution in the offing. Five minutes left. Could be a chance to break here. Real chance. And still danger here. Well, really calm, composed goalkeeping there. It certainly was on the second attempt. It was the first save that really stood out. That was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping. There to win it back. Romina Nunez. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Promising looking ball. It's got to be. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Who's going to get on the end of it? No nonsense clearance. There it is. The final whistle, disappointment in the camp because it goes into the books as a defeat, Stuart. You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball and then just a few mistakes at the back and it's cost them. Poor performance all round.